Oh guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to install UE 4SS into your PAL world. So first of all, you're going to go here on GitHub, then you're going to write down UE 4SSS releases. And basically this is the latest version. Uh, after you are here, you want to scroll down until you will see this zip file. You want to go ahead and download it. And for example, let's save it to our desktop. Now, once we are on, um, once it will be on our desktop, here it is. You'll want to go to your Xbox or Steam, wherever your PAL world is. For me, it is on Xbox Game Pass. You want to browse your local file. So it would be browse right here for me. It will be the same on Steam. It just go to properties, installed files, and then browse. Then go to PAL world, then content, and then go to PAL binaries. And um, on Steam, you will see Win64. For uh, Xbox Game Pass, you will see WinGDK. Open it. And this is where you will need to paste it. I already did that, so I already see some of the files from here. So what you need to do is, first of all, extract this. Um, extract all. And then let's, for example, extract it to our desktop. You can actually extract it straight to, to there, but here it is. Here are the files. And all you need to do is actually just drag it right there and copy it to WinGDK. Now I already have them, so I'm not, not gonna do that. Uh, but basically that's how it works. And uh, now in order for this to work, you need to go to UE for SSS settings in a folder uh, file, double click on it and open it with a notepad. Once you will be here, you want to uh, find use object array catch. And instead of uh, true, you will see here written true. You want to write down false. Uh, because here it is. As you can see, there's no issue. If you experience game crashes, uh, just go ahead and do that. And after that, uh, you want to go ahead and click File Save and close it. Now, another thing to do is go to Mods uh, folder here. Open it, mods.txt, again with a notepad. And you want to make sure that BP mod loader is set to one and not zero. Just make sure it is here one. And that's it. If this video was helpful, make sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.